For Mr. Peabody, the only thing harder than being the world's most extraordinary dog. Is the president coming to dinner again? You'll see. The Petersons. Welcome to our happy home. He's being an ordinary dad. She hates me. Share your interests. Tell a witty anecdote. Make it work. But don't tell her about the way back. He calls it the way back. It's a time machine. Now that we've seen it, maybe we should go back. Nope. German, Penny, why are you two dressed like ancient Greeks? I've lost her in ancient Egypt. And I got engaged to King Tide, and we ran out of gas. Nature Troy. You used the way back. Yeah, she was into it. Oh, my. Now, oh, dear, he's taking family time. You've used time travel improperly to another dimension. We must rewrite history in order to save the universe. <laughs> ancient Egypt. Boy, your hand's cold, Mr. Peabody. Sherman, that's not my hand. <laughs> that's disarming. Heroes of Greece. Yeah. Someone left this for us. A present. Nice. It looks just like our horse. Should I bring it inside? Can't be rude not to. Yo! Peabody here. <laughs> I did not see that coming. It's much. How do you take off? You just pull down that lever. This one? Oh, boy. <laughs> the most amazing dog of all time is leaving his mark <laughs> on history. Leonardo da Vinci. Mona Lisa. I am halfway done with the painting. She won't even smile. Perhaps I can be of assistance. Oh. Oh. Is everyone amused? We ripped a hole in the space-time continuum. Drop the saber and step away from the futuristic orb. I take off the helm, swim, no man. <laughs> take it easy, bro. DreamWorks, Mr. Peabody and Sherman. Why can't children be simple? Children are not the machines, Peabody. I tried to build one. It was creepy. <laughs> Who? In Rudy and Digital 3D.